What is your full name? Obi Donald Davis Jr. Uh -huh. All right. And uh, did your parents name you after anyone? <laughs> I'm a junior, so I must be named after my uh -huh. dad. <laughs> okay, smarty pants. <laughs> what did people call you as a child? Junior. Okay, and then when were you born? May 5th, 1938. Okay, in what city and state were you born? Pineville, Louisiana. Okay, and did your birth take place in a hospital or at home? At home. Okay, and then what is your mother's full name? Alice Hollins. And her date of birth? Uh, August 1st, 1917. Okay. And then what is your father's full name and date of birth? O.B. Davis, uh, February the 6th, uh, 1915. Okay. And did you know your maternal grandparents? Yes. And then where were their names? Monroe Hollins and Katie Holland, Katie Williams Hollins. Okay. And do you know your paternal grandparents and their names? Yes. What's their name? Benjamin James Davis and Alice Davis. Okay, great. Another Alice. Okay, and then what do you remember about your mother from growing up? She loved the whoopers. <laughs> keep, you, keep you straight, huh? Okay, uh, and then you you got more to say? I'm oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, so, you know, yeah. Mom was uh, wonderful. She, she, she would make sure that we ate before she ate. We, she did a lot of things. She, she worked hard and and kept the family and cook. Yeah, cook, mm -hmm. cook, cook like nobody could throw a meal together in 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, and then um, what do you remember about your father from growing up? Well, you know, he had his ways. He was he was quiet. You hardly ever heard him. You know, he, he was not one that was very vocal. Uh, but uh, but he he was he had a, a, he had a way about him. You know, he he uh, in spite of all his faults, we loved him. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Okay, and then what is your first childhood memory? It's open. Mm. Yeah. Like when you first opened your eyes and you realized you was in the world. Oh, I don't remember none of that. Well, yeah. whenever, when you first remember. <laughs> when I first remember, I must, probably was about three years old. And I remember, because I was the oldest, I, I remember my mom, it for Christmas, I got a, a big uh, uh, a tricycle that I loved as a, as a kid. I thought it was great because Nooney was a baby, so he couldn't get anything. So, <laughs> <laughs> so we uh, it was fun. It was fun then, you know. But as the more the kids come, the less the presents grew. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, you have siblings, and then what are their names? Uh, my oldest daughter, my oldest daughter, my oldest sister, was died uh, just the year that I was born. Mm -hmm. Her name was uh, Joanne Davis, and then I had uh, my brother James Nooney Davis. He was born right after. He was born uh, a year and a half after I was, and then uh, Richard Earl Davis. Mm. He was born uh, two years, three years after I was born. He was born in 1941, just before Pearl Harbor. Mm -hmm. And then I had my sister, uh, my brother Ray Davis. He, he was born in uh, oh, 1943, uh, but he died uh, with uh, in, Inspection of uh, smallpox mm. in 1946, uh, mm -hmm. and then I had uh, my sister Doris Elaine Davis. She uh, we call her Dot, and she grew up. Uh, 
to have three boys and lived uh, for a little while, but she passed away at, nine, at the age of 42 mm. uh, in 1989. Wow. And then yeah. I had uh, my brother Fred Irwin Davis. He lives in Stockton. Mm -hmm. And I have, I think he has uh, six, uh, five children. And then I have uh, my brother, uh, John Paul Davis. Mm -hmm. He has uh, two two daughters, okay. and uh, he lives in he lives in the family house. Uh, I have uh, uh, my brother Jackie Davis. Uh, he passed away in uh, 2010, the, the day before uh, Mom's funeral. Mm -hmm. And we have uh, Lord Wayne Davis, uh, who's next to the last one. And then we have, uh, we had Roger Davis, who passed away this year. Okay. All right. You had a lot, you had a lot of... Yeah, you're going to have a lot of editing to do here, girl. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I tell her. She want to do it at the Christmas party, but it's going to be for the My Heritage website. I'm going to put your link. Yeah. Under your your yeah, um, you have to portrait. you have to edit all of this stuff. Oh yeah. Then, okay. Oh, I will. Okay. Um, did you have any animals or pets growing up? No, we all had a community dog called Buckwheat. He belonged to Uncle Henry, but uh, he became Mama Kate's dog, and after mm -hmm. that, uh, he kind of. Uh, we kind of kept going from uh, everybody uh, was uh, was part of keeping him and, and, and watching with him and playing with him. Okay. <laughs> That's it. I heard about Buckwheat. Somebody yeah. already mentioned him too. Yeah. Okay. Um, what was your favorite hobby in your free time? Playing baseball. Okay. Then football, then basketball, whatever sport was in. Mm -hmm. Okay, what was your first job? My first job, when I was about 10 years old, I used to work for a man, that, his name was Green Wiggins, and he had uh, three cows. I used to help him with his cows. I used to take the cows out, feed the cows, milk the cows. So. Uh, bring the cows in, and I used to get paid a, a dollar and a quarter a week, plus uh, all the milk, a quarter milk every day, and and fruits and, and vegetables. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Took a whole lot. Yeah. Yeah. I don't, yeah. yeah. Really. We. Is that me? You can't call. Her. Yeah. Now no, introduce my me. wife. I got to introduce my wife. Well, I got. I'm getting to her. Uh, okay. Get okay. <laughs> and then what? Um, what is your your occupation or trade, or your last occupation, or have you had multiple professions over the years? I've had a couple. I worked as a warehouse supervisor for 32 years, and then I worked, uh, the last job I worked was at uh, Deluxe Film Laboratories, where mm -hmm. I uh, edited and worked with the uh, film production of movies. That was the last job I had. Oh, good. Okay, now you're married. Yes. Okay, and uh, what's your full name, Miss Barbara Davis? Barbara Davis. Wait, okay. no, that's not her full name. That's yeah. Full name, Barbara Faye Lewis Faye. Davis. Davis. Okay, all right. And then, um, where did you meet your your spouse? You at uh, L.A. City College. Wow. Okay, college student. Okay, and then. Um, what was your occupation, Barbara? Remember your first, first job? What was your first, first job? Uh, first job, I can't remember. <laughs> too, too long ago? Too long ago. Okay. Too long ago. What was, what was your occupation before you retired? I went to school. Yeah. Okay. And then you went to, you worked for the aircraft industry. Okay. All right. And then for you, um, what is the best advice that you could give your grandchildren, great grand, or any great great grandchildren? The best advice. The best advice. 
stay in the hands of God. Always whisper Him. Trust Him to lead your path. Don't try to lead your own self. God is the best advice I can give you. All right. And then, um, last, what do you want people to remember the most about you? You know how much. Okay. Good. It's okay. No. Yeah. <laughs> Just that we were helpful. We tried to be helpful wherever we were. We were. Yeah. Okay. We tried to be helpful. All That's right. It. Okay. Well, thank you, Mr. and Mrs. Okay. Obi Davis. Right. Appreciate it. <laughs>